sound so bad if some people didn't try to play with big meaty claws? What did you say, punk? Big meaty claws! I've been studying morphology for over a decade, which led to an interest in how the human body naturally develops, contrary to plastic surgery, and this is what my opinions are based on. Yes, this is my informed opinion. I make this content to be informative, entertaining, to challenge prejudice against plastic surgery, and to dismiss unattainable celebrity beauty. Let's keep the comments civil because this is certainly not worth getting blocked over. Now let's get it. Young throughout his career has kept his hair on the longer, shaggy side, making it easier for him to conceal what I believe to be a forehead reduction. This is a cosmetic procedure meant to lower and thicken the appearance of the hairline. Only in more recent years has he opted for hairdos with no bangs, and that decision has matured his look a lot. Finding a picture or video of Tae Young's hairline before 2019 is very rare, these are the only two I found. Here's to random more examples of what this procedure looks like when actually done well. And lastly, I believe Tae Young to have had a nose job. A lot of people like to chop this visual difference up to maturity, yes. As you mature your features can become more harmonious. Like Tae for instance who once had a very very small round face now has a masculine square face. Notice how in younger photos with the small round face, his eyes appear much bigger than on the right with a wider square face. They appear bigger but we all know they aren't actually and they stayed the same shape. This is what it means to grow into your features naturally. And the same thing applies to the nose. Yes the nose can appear smaller in comparison to a face that grows. But that's not going to change. The shape of the nose. The shape the shape of Young's nose is visually different. This part of the nose here, the lateral wall of cartilage, is much slimmer and newer. Photos which makes his nasal dorsum much more defined. This is due to a rhinoplasty. This kind of rhinoplasty is so common in Asia. In many medical spaces it's literally called an Asian rhinoplasty. Here are two pictures of the same procedure on different people. His columella, the part of the nose a septum piercing would go in, is much smaller, resulting in his whole nasal tip to not only be smaller but go from round to square. If you look at pictures of him smiling his nasal tip, has a more pinched look than it did in his earliest photos. See how in more recent photos from the nasal bone, down into the cartilage his nose made a triangular shape and now it just goes straight down due to a nasal reconstruction this is achieved through a nasal tip plasty and here are two pictures of the same procedure on different people I believe Jin to have had two different eye surgeries. Firstly, I think he got an epicanthoplasty. This procedure is known as double eyelid surgery because it can give you double lids. But that's not its only purpose. An epicanthoplasty surgically elongates the inner corner of the eye so it can also make the eyes longer at the inner corner and wider vertically. Most idols who go under the knife get this done. So you'll be hearing a lot about this procedure in this series. Here are two examples of the same procedure. And I also believe him to have had a lateral canthoplasty, aimed to enlarge the lower outer corner of the eye. This helps give the eye a more open or rounder appearance. Here are two examples of the same procedure. Jungkook's nose extends to a far lesser distance now than when he was a teenager. Something like this can only be achieved through a rhinoplasty. I believe him to have had a nasal tip plasty to make the tip of his nose smaller. As a result, his columella is far smaller than it used to be, which can sag due to aging. Any change to the columella that isn't sagging can only happen due to injury and or surgery. There is an upturn to his nostrils with an increase of the nasal hole, which again cannot happen naturally. This can be caused by an alar base reduction or alar plasty, aiming to narrow the width of the nostrils. Evidence of an alar plasty and nasal tip plasty can be seen here, in the abrasions on the inside of the nose, and the asymmetry of his nostrils. And I do believe him to have a nose implant, in hopes of making his naturally round nasal tip sharp and his nasal bridge straight. I know some fans like to believe this is an everlasting pimple, but there's a record of the implant shifting. The blunt straight implant contradicts the naturally rounded bulbous shape of his nose so the skin stretches, sort of like the way breasts can stretch the material of a shirt. But since this is an implant and not breast meat, the implant causes his side profile to take on a completely unnatural point, even the smallest, straightest, pointiest nasal tip rounds because it is flesh, an implant is not. <laughs> Ah! Ah! 
안 뜨거 안 뜨거 내가 찬물 사 Even before I'd seen Namjoon before his nose job, I figured he'd gotten one because it looks as if he did. The amount of nostril show he has, along with the positioning of his nostrils looks completely unnatural to me. And just like Jungkook there's what looks like a surgical scar underneath his nose, which is a clear sign of work. Even in some edited photo shoots, the surgical line is still apparent, but I was more confident that he'd gotten a nose job. By this pre-debit clip of him, when he was 17 where you can clearly see his nasal tip, is significantly larger than it is now. I believe him to have gotten both an alar plasty and nasal tip plasty. There's speculation that he got a nose job, because of a deviated septum. The septum is in the nose bridge, not the nasal tip or nostrils. He likely did what most people who get a septoplasty do, and HD other things revised while he was already under. I think I think people like Namjoon get away with others, not pointing out his obvious nose job a lot because that's not his most striking feature. Someone's always raving about his full lips, or his quote-unquote dragon eyes, so I don't think this takes away from his overall attractiveness at all. I also want to add that Namjoon got a nose job before he even debuted. He was a child, being an idol means being ridiculed for your visuals, and he's been a victim of the Korean beauty standard his entire career. Fans of his members, when to this day, actively degrade his looks in comparison to his friends. But he has hasn't succumbed to the pressure, enough to further change himself, like his eye shape or skin color, or even his, in my opinion cool, crooked jaw, and I think one of the most important takeaways from this series, is for you to recognize the lengths people will go to, to look like everyone else, to assimilate, when your unique features are worth having. I believe Yoongi, like Taehyung, got forehead reduction surgery. He too, only in more recent years has started to wear his hair without bangs, before that he kept them long. You can see the lowering and straightening of his hairline here. And if you take a closer look you can see better definition in his forehead and even under his eyes here and here, a result of facial filler. I also believe him to have utilized Moss Eater Botox. This protruding muscle is the Mass Eater muscle in the jaw, meant to help you chew. It's not a part of the jawbone. Botox relaxes muscles. A muscle that's relaxed long enough shrinks due to the lack of use. His mass eaters are much smaller than in the past few years giving his jaw a smoother look. Unless he suddenly stopped chewing or talking these muscles were not going to shrink to this extent by themselves. Especially not with him having reached full adulthood with them remaining a prominent feature of his. Jungkook and Jungwon are two people who had very similar shaped mass eaters to Yoongi. Woonyoung and Yunjin are other people to have likely utilized mass eater Botox. I believe him to have gotten a chin implant and or chin filler. In older pictures, you can see a very deep dip between the bulb of his chin to just below the bottom lip. The dip is no longer there or is far less deep. There's no natural progression that explains this. Maturing and weight gain do not do this. From the front view, you can not only see that his chin has gotten longer, you can notice that it used to protrude outward in a square shape even into his 20s. In more recent years his chin has taken a more V-shape along with its new length. This ultimately makes his whole face longer. This is a completely unnatural looking change. And lastly I believe him to have an immaculate nose job. Again, like Young, his nasal bridge is now much thinner, giving it new definition. His columella is smaller and his nasal tip also has that more pinched look now, as opposed to how it used to be. Because they're smaller there's also an increase in nostril show, which if I didn't explain already, means the holes of the nostrils are more noticeable and that cannot happen naturally. I think the most noticeable difference about his nose is his nasal tip and nostrils. Early in his career you can see that his nostrils and nasal tip were so round they made complete circles. Now they don't, a result of a tip plasty. You can see it in his columella, because it's made of skin and cartilage any shrinking that happens to this feature is due to an irregularity like injury, deformity, or surgery. His columella and the whole tip specifically are less round and much smaller. And before someone gives the face swelling excuse, not even after his shoulder surgery and he gained the most weight we've seen him take on did his nose swell. It was the same, both pictures were taken after I assumed he had surgery. On the left is before his shoulder surgery where he gained weight in his face. And his nose is the same on the right after losing that weight. His cheeks just got bigger. And speaking of his cheeks, a lot of people assume him to have had buckle fat removal but I don't think so. Yoongi always had faint rounds to the highest part of his cheeks and faint cheekbones. It's just more noticeable now because of the new length of his face. <laughs> 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 Ha <laughs> ha! 
I believe Jay hoped to have had a nasal tip plasty and nose implant. It looks as if he had a nose job that was even more noticeable when he lost a lot of weight before enlisting. But also looking at the older photos of him you can see his nasal bridge was always high but flatter than physically possible to grow into. And his nasal tip especially was flatter and wider than his now much more structured nose tip. Like Namjoon, J-Hope got this probable nose job when he was very very young, and I find it admirable to be subjected to some of the most extreme levels of physical criticism, harassment and bullying that I've ever witnessed and not further change himself to cater to these criticisms of his appearance, takes resilience I don't think a lot of people have. I believe Jim meant to have had a nasal tip plasty. His nasal tip is naturally wide. I believe him to have gotten refined to give it definition. Now when he smiles his nose takes an arrow-like shape. When I first recognized Tae Young, because of Jim Men's admittance of trying to be just like him I immediately recognized how similar their features are. I wouldn't be surprised if when he got his tip plasty Tae Young was a sort of inspiration. Some people think he got a lip lift but from what I've seen there are too many pictures where his philtrum looks the same length in order for me to believe that. It's speculated that he's had eye surgery to balance out his ptosis, which I also assume he got from his father because he shares very similar looking eyes, and Jim Men could have had this done. But I will point out that his eyelids still have an uneven droop that is very noticeable. He's always had a rather strong square jaw so I don't understand the motivation behind the chin implant speculations. And I don't believe him to have had buckle fat removal. Based on footage of Jim Men's father, he closely resembles him. His eyes, chin, and jaw take on a very similar shape. The buckle fat is this patch of cheek fat here that's still quite a prominent feature of Jim Men's. I believe through the years his face has just slimmed out during certain times because of drastic weight fluctuation. This can happen when subjected to the completely unnatural and unrealistic expectation of being as skinny as possible. I think his fuller face is more lifted, gives him a happier look. Drop top push, roll me on my wrist hey. Diamonds up and down my chain Diamond J. Cardi B straight, sunny sail, tell me Nothing balls up and I chain the game uh -huh. Uh -huh. It's my beat, bro, and he got all the boys shoot, shoot. shoot. My big fat ass got all the boys shoot Whip him on the pills, now we poppin' rubber bands Put him the same to me while I do my money dance like Hey, flexing on the gram like Hey